Hello, my name is Braylon Brooks, and I'm here on the red carpet at the 20th LA Film Festival here in Los Angeles with NC Hiking, director of Sounds of Redemption and producer uh, James Egan. So tell us about when does your film premiere? It premieres Saturday night and uh, at 6.50 p.m., and we're thrilled. I know. like All the hard work is finally coming together, right? <laughs> three years. Three years. Three years? It took us a year to get into San Quentin to shoot the film. Really? I mean, it's that hard to get into San hard, Quentin no. nowadays. <laughs> Hard work pays off. No room. <laughs> but now there's room. I always said there's enough room on a bus for all of us. Exactly. So tell me a little bit about the film. It's about a, an incredibly gifted musician who was also a really flawed human being. And uh, he was meant to be Charlie Parker's successor. And he kind of fell down in the heroin hole. And uh, Heroin? Yeah. And uh, he That's paid. pretty intense. Yeah, it's intense. He paid a big price because he spent about 30 years in and out of jail. But the wonderful thing is that he got out and he started playing the most incredible, beautiful music and redeemed himself. It's all about redemption. It's all about redemption. He started a jazz band in San Quentin. Uh, the ja the uh, San Quentin All Stars and some great jazz legends all came together to form this band. And Frank said it was the best band he ever played in. And this is a guy who played with Billy Holiday and some major people. So uh, that's huge. Yeah, and this is new because people really aren't aware of this amazing jazz history that go went on in San Quentin and how many great jazz artists played in this band. Uh, who are some of the people there? There was Art Pepper. There was Dupree Bolton. There were a whole bunch of people who cycled through because they were getting arrested you know <laughs> yeah it's doing heroin <laughs> yeah kind of and then but the thing was it was so good it was such a good band that the people from all over the Bay Area would come to San Quentin go into the prison to hear this prisoner band wow that's epic that is like yeah it was not nice. unheard of you get you get to see the film because this extraordinary musicians Mark Gross is right now in New York what's the show he's in after midnight he's in after yeah. midnight and he's brilliant and beautiful and his his music makes you cry, it's so beautiful. And okay. yeah. so are you guys ready for tonight to see the premiere? Oh, we're thrilled, yeah, we're yeah. This she is wanted to see it in Paris. <laughs> <laughs> she lived next door to the theater, she couldn't get there. Oh, you live in Paris? I do, yeah. I envy you right now. Oh, Everybody well, does. And see how I can take me with you in your suitcase. All right, it's a deal. <laughs> Come down. Well, thank you so much for giving us our TV interview. Have a wonderful day. Thank you.